Hello there. I would really appreciate any suggestions or comments. Also, if you liked the video, smash that like button. And if you want more, subscribe and turn on notifications. Thanks for being here, now let's start. What is the dumbest question someone legitimately asked you? A co-worker at the library was asked for aerial photos of the Colosseum in Rome. Before it was in ruins. I was weighing a patient. And she asked me if it measured in Celsius. About 25 years ago, I was explaining time zones to a 20-ish year old intern at a large scientific agency. She wasn't getting it, so I got an orange I brought for lunch and used it as the earth. Me. Okay. Pretend this is the earth. The sun only shines on one side, so it's day on approximately half at any given time. Now since the earth rotates, as I spin the orange. In turn. So wait, hold on. So you're saying the earth is round. I wish I was joking. Someone asked me at work if this mirror was expired, because it had a manufactured date on the back. My eyes are two different colors. And the question I'm most often asked about them is. Did you know your eyes are two different colors? I'm amused when someone asks me. Whether I see different colors out of each eye. Or. Even better. Whether, I see in 3D. Boss. Could you print out that file, scan it, and email it to me? Me. I could just email it to you. Boss. In grade 10 science, a girl argued vehemently with our teacher that zebras were a mythical creature, like a unicorn. After asking why they paint the stripes on the horses for the nature videos. I assure you, it was not a troll. I once had an argument with a friend over whether or not a milkshake is a dairy product. She was in her second year of culinary school. I used to work for Bank of America as a teller. Someone gave me half a $20 bill and asked for $10. They did not understand that it's either worth $20 or nothing. I used to work at Disney World and a question I would get on the daily is what time is the 3 o'clock parade? I was asked multiple times if the Space Mountain ride actually took them to space. Working IT desk. Do you all have any of them wireless internet cables? My steady deadpan blinking face wasn't enough of a response. So my colleague chimed in and said, it's already plugged in. Do foreign exchange students go home to do homework? Yes. Someone really asked that. Are you Korean? No. Why? Because you're skinny. And all Koreans are skinny. Well, I'm Filipino. But Filipinos are usually more chubby. Aren't they? Why do meteors always land in craters? Watching a documentary on dinosaurs in class once. Girl sitting at table in front of me. Turns around as the documentary is playing. Hey. They didn't have cameras around when there were dinosaurs. Right? I just turned to my friend and we both started laughing. Good times, I miss geology. So, Trump is our president, right? Does that mean he's in charge of our state? Or, the whole world? Sorry, but I've never understood this whole president thing. This was asked to me by a fellow high school senior. In civics class. Is that an uppercase space bar? American. Do you have airplanes in South America? Me. No. I got here swinging on vines that hang from our trees. Was asked to a friend of mine who worked in a bookshop. Excuse me. Do these stairs go up? I had long hair in high school. I had a classmate who wanted to grow out his hair that wasn't very bright. He asked me in full seriousness. Can you water your hair to make it grow faster? And I just looked at him and I laughed at him pretty loudly because I thought he was joking. He wasn't. Do you see in panoramic view? I'm Chinese. Can you teach me how to speak Canadian? 
after handing me a 50 cent coupon, and me explaining the finally cost was 2.50. Well damn how much was it before the coupon? 3. When I moved back to Florida from Scotland, a girl I was hitting on at a bar asked me how long a drive that was. When I moved from Texas to Hawaii I took my truck. One guy saw the Texas plates and said, How did you get your truck over here? Low tide, I said. I wear a hat scarf. And someone once asked me if I had ears. What day of the week is Good Friday on this year? Huh. How can you have people on a conference call when there is only one phone in the office? Me. What do you mean? Huh. If all these people need to be on this call, how can they do that when there's only one phone? This was a secretary of 20 years. A couple years ago, my aunt asked me if my hair color was natural, which at the time my hair was purple. Why did it rain just here and nowhere else? The sprinklers had been on. My stepmom once asked if islands float around in the ocean. My brother burst out laughing, and I just looked flatly at my dad and said, You married this woman. We still give her grief about it. While walking on a trail to the peak of a snow-covered mountain in Alaska in early summer. Is that real snow? Didn't even know how to answer that one. Where are you from? Argentina. Oh, that's the capital of Brazil, right? This happened three times, in three different situations, while visiting the US. If I punched you, would your brother feel your pain? Said one idiot to me, a twin. No, but you might. I used to work customer service for an auto parts company. Here are some of the best that I can remember. How long is the 8 inch antenna? How big are the 18 inch wheels? Repeat those two, with literally anything that had dimensions as part of the name. Can I just put 2 quarts of oil in my car to save weight? Why can't I put 17 inch tires on my 18 inch wheels? One time in high school, this guy I sat next to in art class, was trying to etch something into his desk, with the metal edge of a ruler. He turned to me and asked, Hey man, do you have a hammer? I was walking around in Walmart with a significant other, we were looking at coolers, when a lady with an empty stroller asked us, what they were. What are those for? The coolers? Yeah. They? Keep things cold. I was flabbergasted. Do they work? What? I couldn't answer, and we walked away. I used to work at GameStop, and I had to explain to an adult woman. That Wi-Fi was invisible, and wind couldn't blow it away. Context. At a food chain, where they serve chili cheese with Doritos. Celery, salt and onions are optional on top. I order one and say, onions only. Not sure if employee was new or not, but he responded. Do you want the chili, Doritos and cheese as well? Nobody, just a cup of onions. Way too late to the party. I work in a bank, we have a credit card which is free for the first year. This girl spent every penny on it, thinking she would not need to pay back anything for the first year. I used to fly tourists over the Hoover Dam and the Grand Canyon. One day a passenger asked me if the Hoover Dam was man-made. This of course after I had already told them when and how it was built. I'm not sure how else they thought it might have gotten there. Beavers in hard hats? I'm so congested. Do boogers come from the brain? This was my 25 year old friend, who was 100% serious. My husband's fraternity house had several waterbeds that just got passed from year to year. One guy asked another, do I fill the bed then carry it back? Dude was like, do you know how heavy that many gallons of water is? Get a hose. Then he asked do I put the plug up or down? I don't want to feel it if it's up. This was one of the top rated engineering schools in the country. 
Book smarts and common sense are not the same thing.